Today we are going to learn about mechatronics in the view of mechanical engineering. Mechatronics can be defined as a mecha and a tronics, where the mecha means mechanics and tronics means electronics. In other words, technologies and developed products will be incorporating electronics more and more into mechanisms, intimately and organically, and making it possible to tell where one ends and the other begins. There are various definitions about mechatronics, few of them are as on the screen. One is integration of electronics, control engineering and mechanical engineering as given by W. Bolton. Another definition can be said as application of complex decision making to the operation of physical systems. Also it can be defined as a synergistic integration of mechanical engineering with electronics and intelligent computer control in the design and manufacturing of industrial products and processes. As you can see on the screen, there are various systems incorporated in mechatronics. One is the control systems, the electronics part is there, mechanics is there, mechanical systems is there, CAD is there and the last the computers is there. Means in this case, we can use the combination of mechanical and electronics in automotive, aerospace, medical, xerography, defense systems, consumer products, manufacturing and materials processing. As you can see in the figure, there are various tools. On the left hand side, we can see the hand drilling machine, computer, cars, stealth bombers, high speed trains, the consumer electronics that is camera and MEMS all these aspects can be modified and worked out with the help of mechatronics systems. The main applications of mechanical engineering in mechatronics is the micro factory. In this case as we have worked or talked about CNC machines in a similar way at micro level we can have the small machining center which will be doing all the parts automatically by the sensors and with the help of electronics media. In the figure you can visualize there are two via audio pictures reflecting the micro factory and one is the drilling unit means the drilling will be controlled with the help of piezo elements and the diamond tools which are of 5 micro radius can also be controlled with the help of this electronics. The CNC bending we have already learned about CNC machining, but the CNC machining can also be controlled with the help of electronics and the accuracy and precision can be achieved in the machining with the help of mechatronics. Other examples are the CNC machining which gives the highest accuracy and the moreover in the demanding world we can create very complex shapes and dimensions. The basic application of mechatronics nowadays is in automobiles where the mechanical components are step by step either assisted by electronics or directly they are altered with the help of electronics that is brake by wire system where brake system that is ABS system which is nowadays used is totally controlled by electronics then the steering mechanism where we also call as power steering it can also be controlled with the help of electronics or can be made effortless in the case of automobiles. The inlet and outlet ports which are nowadays controlled by camshafts can also be controlled with the help of sensors and timers in the electronics thus avoiding total camless engines. Similarly, these equipments will reduce the weight also achieve the fuel economy and there will be a freedom of design along with the safety and of course the cost will be reduced along with the weight reduction. Here is one example of where the door system module is shown in the figure where we can control the door opening and the window moving up and down with the just one switch. This is achieved totally with the help of mechatronics. Initially it was operated by a handle and it was a laborious job but nowadays we can provide total locking system or a child lock 
or the total uh, window locks in one button and this is achieved with the help of CAN bus that is a part of again a mechatronic system. You can see the other modules here, the seat module, it is a part of mechatronic systems. In transportation, where a great deal of uh, mechatronics is used, the basic example is high speed trains. The train position, their velocity, their margin, their speed totally can be uh, controlled with the help of mechatronics, even though the speed may be near about 574 kilometers per hour. As in the figure, you can see that uh, system uses means pressure sensors, microcontrollers, motors, onboard power sources, and the advantages are the simple and intuitive personal transportation device, which is nowadays shown in uh, many big malls. Mechatronics systems, as applied in smart robotics applications, you can see that a uh, big dog, as seen in the figure, which can carry up to 150 kg and run at a speed of 4 miles per hour. It can climb, run and walk. Moreover, it can <coughs> have, it can walk on rough roads also. Means, the, it can be used for mapping, for Google, where a normal person or a human cannot travel. As you can see in the figure, it can be used to clean the gutters automatically with the help of sensors and mechanical aids, vacuum floors, then you can see the phonics, Mars, blenders and so on. So the mechatronics can be used in all the engineering field efficiently with variety and cost reduction. Thank you.